And this thing is super responsive. Yeah, man. like, things that are Bro, as soon as you touch the throttle, it's just, oh man. It's gonna boogie. It's gonna be crazy. Dude, that's crazy sounding. That, that sounds good. amazing. That's definitely I never said I never heard one of these sound like that. Oh my yeah. god. <laughs> you hear it once you get on it. What I like is the rest of this fucking exhaust in the middle. Oh yeah? Yeah, those those squish together clamps are like they've got a blow apart with wow. all that boost going through there. <laughs> oh yeah, you can hear it. It's really nice. And this thing is super responsive. Yeah, yeah. Like things that are right. Bro, bro, as soon as you touch the throttle, it's just oh man. It's gonna boogie. It's gonna be crazy. No leaks, nothing. You're good. We're good. Yeah, everything looks good, man. It kind of sounds like it doesn't even need a tune. We want to get the AFR on this thing, and yeah, it, it sounds like it wants to rip, man. So there it is, guys. We just started it up. Sounds absolutely amazing. You could totally hear a difference in not just the exhaust note, but you could hear those turbos spooling up. The only thing really left to do is some wiring and uh, the tuning. So I'm really pumped to see what Roger has has in store. I've really let him take the lead on this. Uh, this is a, a project that I had full trust in what he's capable of doing. He said, "Let you know, give him a shot," and that's exactly what I'm going to do. I'm really excited to see what it's going to put down on the dyno. Now, keep in mind, I'm going to say 93, which kind of limits the output of the engine. I, he's kind of 
really pushing me towards MS109 or some kind of a race fuel and I really don't want to do that. I want to I want to stick with 93 and I believe at that point, you know, my cap, my my ceiling really with 93 is about, you know, 950, which is even insane power to me, wheel horsepower. I'll be very happy with 850 range, but uh, we're gonna see how it goes. You know, I'm really, like I said, I'm giving the keys to Roger, see what he's capable of doing. He's never disappointed me in the past, so um, I'm really pumped, you know? It was really amazing hearing that thing for the first time in two and a half weeks or so, and I'm excited to get it back in my driveway and, and rip around and, and have some fun. So, guys, I know a ton of you have been waiting uh, for, you know, an update, a real update on it. And I can't wait to get you, you know, dyno footage and, and everything like that. But, you know, with the twin turbo setup, it's a little bit more into, you know, it's a little bit more lengthy in the installation than, you know, a basic, basically a bolt-on supercharger or a pro charger or some kind of a centrifugal force supercharger. So there's a lot more plumbing that's going in involved in this. So, you know, it is what it is. But, uh, you know, I think they're crushing it and I can't wait to see the results. And uh, guys, stay tuned. If you haven't already, definitely make sure you hit that subscribe button. We are trying to get to 100,000 subscribers this year. I really, really am hoping that we do it. It's a huge milestone and, uh, you know, guys, for those of you that that are subscribed thank you for liking commenting sharing all that kind of good stuff with that being said guys i'll catch you on the next video Dude, that's crazy sounding. That sounds amazing. That's definitely, I never, I never heard one of these sound like that. Oh my God.